family day out today at Holton Hall. must be one of the only places in the area that still ha actually has uh, an ice house where they used to keep or conserve their food. I want a nice house, not for keeping food in, but for cooling down in the summer. I've lost them already, they're off. Okay. So these are the kinds of events they have on uh, uh, Holcomb Hall. Today, a Macmillan Cancer Support event. Still actually privately owned this place since, I think, 1609. Usually taken over by, uh, what, what, what are they? The people that usually take over all these. Well, we go and always say, oh. Oh, hang on. What are they called? <laughs> That's gone. I know what you mean, though. It's, uh, it's completely gone. It's gone. gone. <laughs> People that take over places, there you go. Oh. Na nature. National. National. No. no. <laughs> it is something like that, isn't it? National. Oh, no, hang on. National. No, no it's not. Stop saying that word. Natural national? No. <laughs> um, <N> nah. <laughs> national Trust! No! It is! is it? National Nash Trust! Duh. National Trust. They're usually taken over by National Trust, these sort of places. And, uh, yeah, but this place isn't. Still privately owned. Quite good of the owners, actually, isn't it, to open all this up to the public. Normally the house Just is open, you can go in and have tours inside, and um, they've got art galleries and stuff in there, haven't they? Yeah, but it's, was it, six pounds to park in the car park? Six, all day? That was five last year. Six pound all day, though, I don't think that's bad. You can spend the whole day here, chilling on the grass, going for walks, bring your bike. There's a park in the high wire, zip line. Bike hire? Bike hire, do bike hire. Got electric bikes as well, haven't they? Yeah. Yeah. Park for the kids. They have food stalls, don't they? I think they've they even got a coffee coffee shop, haven't they? Oh, they got ice cream. Um, ice cream, coffee shop. Coffee shops. Probably about 15 quid in ice cream, but <laughs> they've got them if you want them. Come for a run. Some good trees to climb. Jackson! Yeah. Good trees. Yeah, they are, look, for kids. Look at that tree, Johnny. Bet you could walk yeah. up that. Quite often come here for a walk. That anyway. is, isn't it, darling? It's a nice day out. I'm looking. I am looking. Not, yeah. not so busy. Like all the seaside resorts and things. It's nice and chilled here. Gone, darling. Oh, I forgot. They've got a nice lake as well, haven't they? Big lake over there at the back. It's full of um, really goslings, baby geese. They are, aren't they? Yeah. And you've got all the deer, haven't you? Here. Oh yeah, deer. Usually hundreds of deer here, but I haven't seen They're any. They're up near the car park today, yeah. darling, yeah. When you first come in. I don't know where she's going. She just started walking off. Maybe she's going for a poo or something. I think she's broken. Mm. Yeah, we poo, maybe. I think she might be looking for an antler. Is it an antler or a horn? 
I don't know. Can anyone tell us why dogs always want to eat medicine. these sticky ball things? If they're medicine, Are they nice, Roxy? You've nice got a snack. On your back. Sticky balls. You have a spider. Where? On your back. Chris! <laughs> Chris! <laughs> no. Holcomb Hall is probably a, one of the only places you can ride an electric scooter legally. And I can be a child. <laughs> that does turn you into a child when you're riding one of these, doesn't it? It's actually quite fast. That's something I forgot to mention actually. The Holcomb Estate actually goes all the way down to the beach. or well, the sand dunes, isn't it? Right yeah. up to the sand dunes. Yeah. Which is probably, what, three mile from where we are now? Yeah. Quite a big estate. God knows what it's worth. 26 miles apparently. <laughs> flies everywhere. What have you got? Deer horn. Deer horns. Little baby ones. Antlers. Antlers, that's it. I was looking, I forgot what the word was, <laughs> <laughs> was earlier. Oh. Where'd you find them? In the, In the woods over there. Oh. Oh. What are you going to do with it? He's going to put it on a shelf. It's a trophy. It's a good find, that's what it is, Johnny. Interesting. That's Take it. it in school. It's a good antler. That's a, <laughs> that's a good find. Roxy, do you, want a bit, do you want a bit of that cake? <laughs> yeah, your mouth is watering a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> you like cake? Oh, I've had it all. Oh, well. <laughs> you know the muffin man? No. <laughs> muffin man? I really do. Oh. What the hell was in that chicken? <laughs> what was in that chicken? Why? Oh, what was that? No, I had muffin in my mouth as I said it. Yeah, and that went apart. Oh, oh, well, it really did. And that's another advantage of Holcomb Hall. Kids are in that park. We're sunbathing. And we lay in the sun. And. A lot of places don't let you bring food into into premises. They want you to buy their fucking stuff, um, their stuff. <laughs> their fucking stuff. Right. <laughs> well, they're ridiculously priced. Seventeen pound fifty for a six-inch margarita, or nine pound fifty for a cheese and I pickle sandwich. I don't think they're fussed about that here. All they're worried about is no. The, but you get it's nice because you can bring a picnic, hey, and a lot of people like play games on that field. They set, they play cricket and football and all sorts, don't they? They're making their money from the car park. Um, when there's events on here, actually, they fill up the field at the back here, don't they? Well, they just the don't fill more and more of the field. The field is full. But they do put some money into the grounds, don't they? Because there's got lots of people working here, groundsmen, and that park must have cost a bit. Um, God knows what the upkeep of the building is. That's crazy. I think we've just been lucky this, this, every time we come here, it's sunny. I'm sure we just go off a sunny day to see Holcomb Hall. Yeah, either that <laughs> probably as well. <laughs> it's sunny today, let's go to Holcomb. <laughs> 